Hello, this is Seth Lewis from Lantern Home Inspections here to perform a sewer line camera inspection on property 11121 Southeast 31st Avenue, Milwaukee, Oregon 97222. Current time is uh, 1025 a.m. on October 6, 2023. The house is facing east. I'm here on the west side of the house, uh, northwest, where I've located a uh, four inch cast iron clean out. I actually had to remove the cap of this clean out because the exterior one had too many turns in the line before it actually went down to get to the lateral. So it wouldn't allow uh, my line to properly proceed forward to the downstream towards the main. So this is where I'll be accessing the line for inspection. Purpose of this inspection is to determine the overall condition and serviceability of the sewer lateral for this property to the city main. I um, have the head of my camera downstream towards the main. I'm going to zero out the foot counter here and uh, I have water running from the kitchen sink so I'm going to go ahead and proceed with the scope. You can see me going through uh, a lot of sludge buildup, a lot of sidewall debris stock. Uh, there was that spot there that I'll come back to that had some plastering. And again, there's another exit hole there. And at 41 feet, it looks like we transitioned from cast iron to what appears to be concrete. root intrusion at 53 feet, a bigger root intrusion at 55 feet, another root intrusion is where we begin to, the, it looks like clay, and then right to uh, 3034, which is city, and there's the city main right there at 101 feet. So I'm going to uh, come back to that area for a moment. Uh, there's at least uh, four uh, root intrusions. They're small, but uh, still, anytime there's a root uh, in the line, that's, I will fail that as well. But uh, I'm going to come back to those here in a moment.
possibly some uh, smaller roots there coming through that joint. Okay, so there's one that's obvious right here. So that's where I'm going to mark actually. And then from there, I'm just going to go back and mark, try to mark uh, in here where the, uh, where that plaster type substance is, is making somewhat of an obstruction. I'm going to pause the video for right now. Okay, I'm back. I did mark that out on 56 around uh, the southeast uh, side of the home property. Uh, but as you can see, there's multiple ones there. Uh, now I'm going to come back. And there's another one there. So there's multiple in the, in the concrete section of pipe. And then there's quite a bit of uh, debris and, and uh, sludge buildup on the side walls. On the side walls, uh, so as you can see, all the way through. But there is this one concerning part here where it could be some type of dried plaster, but as you can see, quite a bit of sludge and right there. So it looks pretty hardened. I'm going to pause the video for a moment. So I'm back again. Uh, this is about five feet. And I can't really, as you can hear, I'm looks like it might be under the, oh, there it is. So it's right under the shower area, right under the shower here. So it looks like during the construction, something happened here. And I don't have my water running very, actually it's turned off now. So you can see there's quite a puddle here. Something in the way they're blocking. So that at five feet, right underneath the uh, shower is gonna fail the line as well. So that's gonna have to be looked at as well. At this point, this does fail the sewer line camera inspection for this property. As you saw with me going to and from the city main, there are uh, numerous issues uh, such as uh, this, the, um, there's some type of a, a blockage at around five feet under the shower here in the basement area and then all the way through the cast iron there's a lot of sludge buildup uh, debris buildup on the side walls and then there are at least uh, four root intrusions in the joints of the concrete pipe so this is going to warrant further review by a licensed professional to determine what actions should be taken most likely it's going to be a hydrojet uh, to release all of that away and even get those roots out and that may be all that's needed otherwise this does fail the sewer line camera inspection of this property for my inspection. I will have a written report in this video upload for you and your ruler to view. Thank you for choosing Lantern Inspections.